I'm, <laughs> I'm not afraid to ask someone else how to do something because there's a certain desire that I have a certain level of success that I want to reach and if someone has that I'm going to contact them and I'm going to figure it out happy and you know it say AP happy and you know it say AP what's good is AP one in a billion and I'm back guys I love my neighbors you're supposed to love your neighbors like you love yourself. But for some reason, my neighbors don't love me back. <laughs> for some reason, my neighbors are jealous of me. You could just feel the tension. Jealous of my success. Me and my wife stay at home while they go to their respective jobs. And guess what? We're in our houses. We're in our house and we're working extremely hard building our companies and providing and taking care of our children, raising our children, teaching our children. So why? Oh, why? Are my neighbors jealous of me? I don't get it. I tell you what. I remember the neighborhood that I used to live in, when I first moved there, or as a matter of fact, the whole entire time, anybody famous, anybody successful that I knew in this development in my neighborhood, I'd say, I need to meet that person. I need to spend time with that person. Whether they were older than me, younger than me, whoever it was, you guys can look at my content and you will see me with many celebrities and you'll see us and we're friends we lived in the same community but here it is now my celebrity has grown i have grown in popularity me and my family but the people who i'm around the people who have access all you got to do is knock on my door the people who have access to me <laughs> they're not using that as access instead they have jealousy, bitterness, they cover this. They make statements like, everyone can't be blessed like you and work from home or, or, or own their own company. Why can't you be blessed like that? And if God put me right in the same area as you, shouldn't what I'm able to get be able to transfer right over to you? You live right by me. So, on one end, you have a people who don't know how to tap into their blessing, don't know how to tap into what God has put right in front of their faces. On one end, you have that. And on the other end, you have me, the person who willingly wants to be a blessing to so many people. But many of those people don't want the blessing. So what does that say? What it says to me and what I'm seeing happening is God is calling me to a different place to be around the people who will receive the blessings. Be around the people who want to be blessed by me. You know what I mean? Give me a second. So the time has come for me to move to a community where I'm not the most famous person where I can benefit from all of the other people that are famous because I'm not afraid to go over to someone who has success I want their blessing forget fear I'm not so prideful that I won't go up to that person I'm humble enough that I can say you know what you got something, and I want it too. The late, great Kobe Bryant. Many of us wondered how did he continue to get better at the game? How did he continue to make progress? 
Well, while playing against Michael Jordan, he even stopped to ask Michael Jordan questions. How'd you do this? How'd you do that? He's asking this man this, his, his own moves. And as a result of that, we saw the progress in this game. We saw him continue to get better and better and better to where he became an all-time great. I'm, <laughs> I'm not afraid to ask someone else how to do something because there's a certain desire that I have, a certain level of success that I wanna reach. And if someone has that, I'm gonna contact them and I'm gonna figure it out. Many of you, I've done stuff that many of you desire to do, but you failed to ask me how to do that. Instead, you've spent years and years and years and I've watched you on trying to figure that out. And you haven't achieved what I've achieved. All you gotta do is ask the person that's achieved something. And then you too, my friend, can be on your way to success. So like I said, you gotta be humble, man. You gotta be willing to learn. Every day of my life, I tr strive. I wanna learn something new. So in order to do that, I need to be around people who are on another level than me. People who can sharpen me where I'm weak. Not around people who are jealous of me. Not around people who are envious of me. I look to my left, I got neighbors who are talking behind my back. Look to my right, I got neighbors who are talking behind my back who don't wanna, <laughs> they don't want access. Their, their stubbornness and their pride is stopping them from gaining access. Therefore, they're struggling. And me, I still love my neighbor. I still will come to you. I don't wanna see you struggling. I wanna see you doing good. That's what's inside of me. As long as you don't do anything to physically harm anyone in my family, I don't care what you got to say. I still wanna see you succeed. And I'll try to help you. But you guys gotta learn how to serve. When you learn how to serve, that is when you will be multiplied. That is when God will open doors for you that no man can shut. I've been learning from so many great people. Many people say, oh my gosh, AP, you know how to do this. How do you know how to do that? How do you know how to do this? How did you learn how to code? How did you learn how to develop web platforms? I served under other, other people who did. You know what I mean? God, he put that in me. The Holy Ghost straight up gave me those skills, but I learned from other people. How did I become so successful on YouTube? I was good, but I learned from other people as well. I'm not afraid to serve. You guys want all of the, all of the rewards, but without investing the time, without serving. So, all I can say is for myself is the time has come for us to go to another level. Get ready. And my question is, are you ready to go to another level? If you are, hit me up. I'm here, all right? Coach AP is here. CoachAP.net. I'm offering my services to you guys on CoachAP.net. Services that can take you from not making any money to making money. <laughs> How simple is that? You invest a little bit in yourself and then it multiplies. So stop being afraid. Stop letting 
fear, hate, jealousy, envy, stop you from getting to where you're called to be. I ain't gonna let it stop me. <laughs> that stuff don't even exist with me. All right, so coachap.net. You can get sessions with me. I do video reviews, which will help you on how to enhance your videos, how to enhance your businesses. I do courses, which will educate you, educate you on how to better your business online, how to make money online. This is something that everybody wants to do. I want to be your coach. I want to be your teacher. You, you can be the student, all right? So hit me up, guys. I look forward to talking to you. Hey, P. One in a billion, and I'm out. Happy and you know it's safe. Hey.